Yo, what is good, YouTube? And welcome back to another JC2K video. In today's video, we're doing gameplay with the brand new Sapphire Kelly Oubre Jr. Before we hop into the video, if you haven't already, make sure you hit that subscribe button. Help me push towards the 16,000 subscriber mark on the channel. I upload every single day. And I would really appreciate it if y'all do subscribe. Without further ado, let's hop right into it. This Kelly Oubre card can be gotten for free in my team. I bought him because I don't feel like doing any sort of grinding for a Sapphire Kelly Oubre card that I can buy for 2,000 BC that I already had on my account. But to get get the card it is quite simple 20 points with sixers players over multiple games and apply three badges play one trip with that offline game with a sixers player score all the points with that sixers player and apply three badges doesn't matter to who doesn't matter how just do that and you will get sapphire kelly Bay for free so it's a very very easy free card to get who is needed for uh sapphire or sorry for pink diamond kobe bryant so if you're good if you're getting kobe make sure you're keeping up with these free agenda players because there are 10 of them they are all free you can buy them as well from the player market but i think it's worth getting as many of them free as possible especially the more expensive ones the amethyst and the rubies uh, but Kelly Oubre, I mean, I do think he's going to be an okay card, at least offensively. He's only 6'6", but he's a pretty good, I mean, he's got good good player build to shooting guard position, 88 offense, 89 defense, 90 driving layup, 90 close shot, 88 mid range, 87 three ball, 87 free throw, 85 driving dunk, 86 ball handle, 85 steal, 84 perimeter, 87 speed, 83 excel, 84 speed with ball, and 86 lateral. Overall, statistically, he's pretty good for a Sapphire. 90 vert, 95 stamina, coming with a 20 golds, 11 silvers, and two bronze badges, including badges such as acrobat, fast twitch, fearless finisher, poster as a pro touch, slithery catch and shoot, corner special screen machine slippery off ball bailout pogo stick bunch of the layup badges precision dunker whistle spot finder silver guard up ankle breaker glove off ball pest blow by triple strike bronze challenger and pick dodger no clamps though no speed booster um no handles for days not a ton of great shooting badges like uh, limitless ranger agent three i mean in terms of key badges he's missing most of them and that is probably the biggest flaw with this card is the lack of badges because statistically he's really really good for a sapphire but the end of, at the end of the day he is a sapphire so at best this is an offensive two guard who is uh pretty good for salary cap let's see what his release looks like actually pretty good really nice release very smooth easy to grade should be a very solid release i mean athletically he's good attacking the rim 85 driving dunk good finisher at the rim so should be an athletic finisher who capable who drives the ball pretty capably with a nice release and moves okay as well at the two so offensively i like the look of this card defensively not super excited um simply because he just doesn't have the key defensive badges St uh, perimeter stats are okay interior stats aren't quite there but i will say this release is absolute butter definitely something that i am a big fan of with this kelly Oubre jump shot so or i should say is this kelly Oubre jump shot and he's looking like a dog on the offensive end of the court so excited to try the card out let's hop into a game let's see what kelly Oubre can do all right our opponent is will vu 21 and he's got d book Kawhi, braun kareem and Giannis. absolutely elite squad with some of the very best cards in the game kelly Oubre jr defensively the problem is you kind of got to hide him and hiding him against the guys got D book at PG is going to be a little tough. I mean, I'm putting him on Kawhi, who's not the best shot creator in the world, but that means SGA basically has to guard Braun because I need my lock, which is broad to guard his D book. So uh, size wise, I don't love all of these matchups so far, but it is what it is. Guard the back door. No block there. And he gets himself a bucket on the first possession attacking me off the back door. I'm actually just going to. Um, Make sure, and I do have my freelance on, right? Okay, cool. We do have our freelance. Let's attack. Let's backdoor Mr. Ubre, and I think he's open. Well, he was open, but he's not really anymore. Um, same side burst here. Ubre attacked the rim, hop step through, and gets through. Oh my goodness. Nice move, Kelly Ubre. Hop stepping through, Deva Booker, and finishing at the rim. That's actually a really good finish, really good bucket. We will take that. First possession of the game. Uh, see what we can do defensively here with Braun. Get through the screen. Good defense. Hub hedge down with here. We're good. Beautiful. Now I think we're in a pretty decent defensive position. Now, Kelly Ubre, even without clamps you have to try your best to stay in front see that's what exactly what i need him to do as long as i can keep him in front and keep him from getting a blow by there then we can wall up Kawhi, and that was a shot too so that's a little bit unfortunate but good move kelly Oubre is hooping right now this is a sapphire going up against Kawhi leonard arguably the best shooting guard in the game right now besides probably the best besides um kobe bryant and maybe jimmy butler like Good backdoor there. LeBron on SGA is just not a very good matchup. Got to do a better job here defensively than I'm doing in this game so far. But um, let's walk, size up here. Let's attack downhill. Let's hit our pop. Catch and shoot Kelly Oubre. That's a wide open three for a great release. Do not think you want to be doing that. And I will take it. Seven points so far. Kelly Oubre hooping against a very good player with a very, very good squad. This is a really capable offensive sapphire. Defensively, he just struggles. If he could defend, he'd be an awesome, awesome budget card. Because that 
Oh, that could be a stop. And I mean, this car would be a damn dog because offensively, he is like that, bro. He can create his own shot. He can play off the ball. His release is nice. He's got a good player build. He just can't. And, he can, and he's a good slasher, too. We've already seen it. He just can't defend. No clamps is going to be a huge issue. You you literally basically have to just try to not even make bodily contact with him on a def, on a uh, offensive player because uh, you don't want him to get blown by there. So attack the ram here all the way downhill. Back out to Ubre. Ubre's open again. I'm going to reject the screen. I'm going to shoot the... Oh, I didn't. I mean, I still. Oh, I thought I hit that. Damn, I went to fade there and I messed it up. That is so tough. And Giannis doesn't play that as well, which is also kind of tough. But that's a tough uh, player right here to wall up here. X switch this. Very good. Now we're back to our corner. We watch our back door. And now we back up and hope that he doesn't shoot over top of me. And back guard the back door again. Why is my CPU jumping? X switch. Get back down to Giannis. Contest. Wall up. Click on. Good D. Somehow gets a stop and Ubre gets the board. That was a scramble drill defensive possession if I've ever seen one, but I will take it regardless. Kelly Oubre, same side burst here now. Attack downhill, back out to the pop. D-Rob open from the mid-range. Okay, never mind. He overcloses out. We'll take our dunk. David Robinson, beautiful stuff. Get back defensively, boys. We're up by five. Two minutes left, playing really well. Oubre's been a huge part of it, having contributed literally every single bucket we've scored. That's a tough three ball with Devin Booker. Not an awful shot, but not a very good one, and he did not time it properly. Same side burst. Kelly Oubre attacking down. On hill dot in the corner catch and shoot and that is freaking annoying that hoff challenger is getting to that for a contest but it is and i shouldn't have shot it and i should have known that was going to happen that's on me at the end of the day wall up there good d d let's go come on man y'all need to go hoop for me then oh and that's terrible he gets a freaking steal on a dunk with cpu brawn that's so tough because we were out in transition there and i had a free dunk in transition with d rob as well that was going to be an assist that was going to be takeover for kelly and everything chill relax relax holy crap we need to take a chill pill right now because we are scrambling right now Def uh, on both ends honestly we'll draw a foul and gold whistle pops up there thank the lord because it's gotten ugly the last couple possessions for sure. A couple mistakes as well, but Ubre to the free throw line. He should be a pretty pretty good free throw shooter, and he is. Knocks down the first one, 83%. Second free throw is also up and good, 85. Even without free points, he's a bucket. He's got physicals takeover, which admittedly is not the best, but I can work with it offensively, and we're going to have to just try to prevent back doors. Okay, and I probably should have been trying to prevent that as well, but if he's going to miss it, that is a lifesaver for me, so... Contest the fade, contest the fade, contest the fade. Give it the back door, give it the back door. Honestly, I'd rather give that up than the fade at this point. Being up by um, three still with a minute four. I don't really want to give up a three ball here. And let's see if we can blow by here. Cannot blow by, but Devin Booker, his weakest defender here. Again, gives me an opportunity to potentially create some shots. Get downhill here, uh, attack inside. Now we can get our uh, defense, or he's now he's forced to, to switch. And now he's going to, oh man, I have him. I just go up, just go up. D-Bob finish. D-Rob, yo, that was a very soft take. Not able to finish at the rim at all. Good attempt by Kawhi to get over, but Kawhi and Kelly Oubre can't do anything about Kareem. And we didn't even really get particularly close to score out of that possession, unfortunately. That was not what we were looking for. This could be definitely more what we're looking for. Downhill that time. Good drive for Kelly Oubre to get his... Uh, what second or third dunk of the game and now he's got 13 of our 15 in addition to an assist doing this offensively against this caliber of team and honestly solid player as well is very impressive to me though so i gotta say i've been very impressed by this Ubre card as a whole i'm willing to give it a back door again at some point it's chance i get the steal or the block but regardless i'm passing it and i'm holding the ball now now he's got to make a defensive play you got to make a a serious defensive play here otherwise i'm just going to hold the ball uh throw it to Giannis. back out to Ubre. 10 seconds left he's going to have to foul um or or try to steal or something he's not even like reaching or anything he's just gonna let me blow by i'm going all the way Ubre gets blocked what am i doing that was the stupidest thing i've ever done i i, I could have dribbled off the clock i thought i was gonna get a dunk and he went up for a layup because he was tired oh i just trolled i if i give up a bucket here i i deserve to lose like no troll i deserve to lose if i give up a bucket here this is Oh, that was that was unfortunate. I'm not gonna lie. That was really, really unfortunate. Uh watch the back door here, Giannis. Giannis, 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 Giannis. He finished that. No chance. Right? Oh my gosh, over two guys. He contact dunked two dudes for the win. Oh, this is the throw. Uh, the, what a throw. I mean. What a throw might be an understatement. I'm not even gonna lie. What a throw might be an understatement. I might have got he might have gave it up. What? Oh my gosh, I made that. I think I made that. Did I mistime it? I what a weird way to end a gameplay. Even though I lose that game. 13, 1 and 1, 5 of 7, 1 of 2 from 3. I don't understand what just happened there, honestly. Um 
that's 2K for you, I guess. Let's hop back to the main menu. Review Kelly Oubre. I... Pretty sure I made that lob at the end, but the fact that I didn't hold the ball there was ridiculous. I don't know what I am doing. That was such a stupid throw, and then he gets a contact lob for the win. Regardless, Ubre offensively was awesome. He competed against a great squad and a very solid player at a very, very high level. The uh, problem with the Ubre card is defensively, he's just a kind of a non-factor. So unfortunately, even though offensively, I honestly do like the card, even without the key speed booster, limitless range type badges, I don't think I'd recommend the card simply because I think he's kind of a turnstile defensively. No clamps is a bit of a deal breaker at this point especially as a point guard, shooting guard, or small forward. So for me, Kelly Oubre, not going to be it in my team. So that is good for this video. I hope you all did enjoy. If you did, make sure you hit that like button, leave a comment, and subscribe. I'll be back with more 2K content very, very soon, and I appreciate you all. Peace.